Hello, this is not from this world and welcome to my first tutorial. I've received a lot of uh, questions from patrons and clients about what I do and how I uh, create my comics. So I thought it would be cool to make a series of simple tutorials. I'm going to try and keep them short give you a little bit of information on each tutorial, not overwhelm you with a huge long, you know, 30 minute video, but keep them short, kind of show you uh, the ropes a little bit. And since this is my introduction video, I thought I would introduce you to the program that I use. It's called Daz Studio. And uh, Daz Studio is pretty cool because it is a, a free program. So if you go to the internet, if you type in Daz 3D, you will come up with the website uh, for Daz Studio. Daz Studio itself, if you go to this technology link here, it is a free download and it's uh, amazing. It's an amazing program. It's really cool that they give it to you for free. You can download it and you can start playing with it. What, uh, what gets you is all of the cool stuff that they sell you. And so, uh, of course, I am a member of uh, their, one of their premier members, so I get discounts. But, um, you know, if you see a character, here's uh, Kiana. Uh, you can click on her, you know, it'll show you your character and give you the price. I remember get a discount because <laughs> I'm one of their members, but um, uh, you have to pay for the membership. But if you um, want to get into this, I want to show you a little bit about Daz Studio. Now, before we get into the program itself, it is important to talk about your system and uh, what kind of computer you need. You cannot just, uh, you know, uh, throw Daz Studio onto any old computer and expect it to, to do the job. My computer is not even the best. Uh, by far, it's not the best. And I just thought I'd show you my specs. And I would say that my computer is probably the minimum of what really can handle Daz Studio. If I could have a better computer, I definitely would. I love my computer, but, you know, I'd say anything less than, than this is probably not going to not going to cut it when it comes to Daz Studio. So first of all, um, I have an MSI computer. It's a gaming computer. And my gaming computer, uh, I honestly, the, the one I have, I bought it at Best Buy. Uh, so it's MSI. It has uh, an Intel i7 uh, CPU, 2.8 gigahertz. Uh, processor, I'd say that's your minimum. You go lower than that, you're not going to be able to create your images as uh, best as, that you want. So uh, also minimum 32 gig RAM. If you have 16 or 8, man, you're going to be waiting for days to make your images. I wait long enough for, for uh, some of mine. Uh, some of you might be familiar with my comic, Sydney and the Dungeon. Uh, some of those images, especially the ones at the beginning, uh, took with this computer with 32 gig RAM and an i7, uh, 2.8 gigahertz uh, processor, still took uh, anywhere from six to eight hours to render one picture. So I... Uh, you know, anything less than this, you're going to have trouble. Um, the uh, Daz Studio that I use is Daz 4.14. It's the most current Daz. If you're familiar with my comics, uh, you'll notice that I kind of have two types of comics. I have a more cartoonish look, 
to my older ones, that was because it was uh, rendered in a previous DAS version, DAS, uh, DAS, DAS uh, Studio 2.0. And it gave this uh, really cartoonish look. And, and I still like those comics, but compared to what I can do with DAS Studio 4.14, it doesn't even compare. I've actually had some uh, people tell me that they like the old style better uh, than the new style, but um, I will never go back to DAS 2.0. In fact, the computer that I was using that ran that program died and um, I've moved on. So I'm using DAS Studio 4.14. So I would say these are your minimum requirements for DAS Studio. And I wanted to tell you this because I, you know, researched this. It was hard to find information about what kind of computer I needed to really run DAS. Uh, the computer that I'm using right here uh, was my first computer. And I paid retail price for it. Uh, about two years ago now, uh, which was at the time around two grand. Now, I have to tell you, I have three uh, computers I use for DAS Studio. And uh, the other two I purchased used, and you can get them uh, probably as cheap as 500 bucks for uh, these uh, specifications. So it's not uh it's not impossible for you don't think that you need to go out and buy a brand new computer i made that mistake when i first got this one and since i've learned that i can pick up a used one that does just as well in fact the second computer i bought actually works a little bit better than my original one here and it uh, renders great so 500 bucks can get you this computer so don't think that you need to go out and buy a new one okay so those are the specs so if you want to give daz studio a try you should download it and then play around it does come with a few free items you'll get some characters so you can actually load people into your scene um you don't have to purchase everything, but eventually you're going to want to look at uh, different things to buy. And so what I highly recommend is if you really want to get into it, um, join their Platinum Club and then look for sales. Uh, if you look at some of this stuff, like um, if I uh, just look at some of the items that you can buy, you can see that because I'm a platinum member, they are already for sale. So like if we click on this character, um, this character here, she is, uh, well, it's her and it looks like it's her hair. So you get the character and you get the hair, which is pretty good, um, for 30% off. And so, yeah, I mean, it adds up, but they also have sales all the time. So if you look, it says bundle blink sale, uh, two hours only. So if you were to click on this, they will give you um, a whole bunch of discounts. Like this whole bundle, this character, Edward Eight, uh, he's if you bought his bundle, it would normally be like 134 bucks, 135 bucks, but... The bundle it goes down to 30 or I'm sorry 47 so you can see you can really save they also have um, forums with freebies and things like that so if we go to the shop um, if you look they have these sales here weekly freebies so you know you can get some stuff for free um, it says get free D models, that kind of stuff. So if you scroll down here, see all of these items are free. So you can get these, uh, I don't know, these funky looking unicorns. And, you know, it just varies. And every week they change those freebies, things like that. 